those showers yesterday, well, that is moving out, and we're going to have quite a bit of wind in the mix as we head into the you next. You can see uh, some high clouds off in the mix there, but not too much. Temperatures on the cool side, 59 degrees, and look at these winds, close to 25 miles per hour, and that is not even the windiest conditions we are seeing out there this morning. Simi Valley seeing winds close to 30 miles per hour. Fraser Park, you've seen winds over 40 miles per hour all morning long. Now, as you start to head east, those winds die down a bit, but Long Beach seeing winds in th over 30 miles per hour, right Wood, you're also noticing those wind speeds over 20 miles per hour. So we do have high wind warnings in effect. This is for our Ventura County Mountains and our San Gabriel Mountains. 20 to 40 mile per hour winds gusts could be as high as 80 miles per hour over the next 24 hours. Now high wind warnings already in place, but we have wind advisories going into effect this evening. And then the concern is going to shift. Not only are we worried about these winds, of course, but red flag warnings going into effect. We're talking about dry and very windy weather. So fire danger going to be a big concern as we head into the next couple days. 12 hour forecast looking ahead. You can see temperatures are really nice. It's just those windy conditions we're keeping a close eye on in the 60s by noon and then Los Angeles only making it to the low 70s today. So we'll be a little bit warmer than what we saw out there yesterday, but temperatures are still staying below average 70s. Tuesday election day expected to be the nicest day of the week. It'll still be breezy out there, but winds will die down a, a tad. We'll see sunny skies and then here we go. Another Santa Ana wind event moves in on Wednesday and lasts through Thursday with temperatures only making it to the 60s. Once this event moves out by the end of the week, we should see nice, sunny, cool conditions. But keep in mind, it is going to feel like winter out the mid 60s today. There's wind sticking around through about midweek overnight lows dipping into the 30s. But Irene, Mark, uh, we've we've traded out summer for winter very quickly.